Hey, it's Midnight Raven, and today we are going to do a shopping haul. So, big bag, incredibly heavy. If you didn't see my stream this morning, you will know that I went out um, and went to the new QD store that's arrived in Swatham. And if you saw my live stream, you will have heard that I, I said that um, there was a massive queue. Today was the opening day. Um, and there was a lot of people. Um, you can now get a discount card from QD as well. Once you go in there, you get to sign up and you get 10% off future shops. You get something on your birthday, apparently a discount. And you get special things for being a QD card holder or something. Um, more details you can find on their website, apparently. But I went in there. I picked up a couple of bits. I'm just going to show you what I bought. So the first item I bought from QD was this Friends bag. The television series Friends, they had all different bags in there. They had How Are You Doing Friends bag. They had the lobster one. Um, they had this one and then they had one that said um, Central Perks. So they had like four different bags that were Friends themed. And then they had various other ones. But I picked this one because if you know me, I have a Friends mask. So I thought I'd get a bag to match. You know, matchy matchy. So, the items I bought first, work, hobby, whatever you call my eBay. So I got seven of these A Manila envelopes. I got five of the C Manila envelopes. I wanted B, but they didn't have any. And then I got five of the D Manila envelopes. And these were just one pound each. Obviously, the bigger the envelope, the less you get. So you get seven in these ones. Uh, you get six, I believe it is in the B, and then anything above a C, you get five, and then anything above a D, I believe you end up getting four, and then it shrinks as you go along. So we've got them three to start with. Okay, next item I got was this watermelon um, cup. This is for my son when he comes over and he's obsessed with eating watermelon. Um, so he asked to have his own personal glass when he comes to stay. Um, so what better than to pick up a watermelon um, glass. This was 99p. Um, it doesn't say if it's dishwasher safe. It says wash thoroughly before first use and that's basically it. Nice glass for 99p. Not a bad price. Sorry, that's just my son. Okay, the next one we got was this beautiful owl mug. Look at this. So on each side, the owl is wearing a hat. Now, there were three other mugs. One was a hedgehog that didn't have a hat. Another one was a rabbit that didn't have a hat. But then there was a stag that had a hat. So I weren't quite sure why two of the animals had hats and the other two didn't. But this one was so cute. And I believe... I believe it was $1.99. Uh, Woodland Animals Mug, $1.99. And it's a pretty sturdy mug. This is microwave and dishwasher safe. So hopefully this print stays on because I love the fact that he's wearing a bowler hat. Kind of reminds me of like Winston Churchill, the owl with the bowler hat. I know, weird. But we're going to go with it. Okay. What else did we get? Next, we got some candles. This is the Black Cherry um, Candle by... Can't see the name of the company. Black Candles by Something Stays. But it's a gorgeous candle nonetheless. It's a three-wick candle, which means it should all burn evenly. It smells gorgeous. It's in Black Cherry. Now these were interesting. These were $1.99 each or three for a fiver. So I got two of the black cherry because black cherry is my thing. And then I got um, one for my youngest, which is called Sweet Apple. And it kind of reminds you of like Granny Smith apples. If you know what Granny Smith apples are, I don't know if they sell them worldwide. But in the UK, they're a really nice green juicy apple. Takes me back to my nan. 
There were three others. There was a vanilla. There was like a lilac. There was one that kind of smelt like the ocean. There was an apple pie one. There was quite a few. There was like six or seven altogether. But um, I just got the three, two of them being cherry. And these were two pounds each or three for a fiver. So I picked up. Of course, I'm going to pick up three. And then we um, got some bath bombs. If um, you're new to my channel, I do bath bombs on Instagram as well. You can check me out at, at the Midnight Raven on Instagram. So these are two ninety nine each, I believe, or three for six quid. I believe these are two ninety nine each. Yeah, these are two ninety nine each, or three for six pounds. Like. <laughs> You're literally getting an entire bath pump for free, which is pretty cool. So the first one I picked up was this flock star. It's got a little flamingo. The second one I picked up was this kind of birthday one. It's my son's birthday coming up soon, so this will be for him. This is party popper, so this will probably go in his bath for his birthday. It's a little cupcake. And then my son loves bath bombs. He's 12. He loves a bath bomb. And then the last one we got is Blueberry Funday. Which has got this gorgeous blue colour with a little heart. And they were, like I said, 2 99 each or 3 for £6. So I bought three. Then, as you know, their lady has bought my entire face mask collection. So I had to go buy some more. So the first two I picked up were two good sellers on my eBay store. And this is the um, Awesome Avocado W7 Mask and the Pomegranate Power Face Mask. Both of these, I must have sold at least 10 each of these now. These are packed with pomegranate extract and avocado. So they're just sheet masks that you put on your face and they just stay on there for about 20 minutes. They were 99p each. Then I picked up this one, which is the Banana Face Mask, which we've never had before in my eBay store. This is the W7 Banana one. Again, infused with banana to help replenish your skin. Then we picked up this. This is the So Juicy Watermelon Sheet Mask. We've got one infused with watermelon. This is for moisture, a dewy finish, glow and ultra cooling jelly formula. So this is like a jelly mask, so it's a little bit more, it's meant to make a cold soothing feel to your skin. That was 99p. Then I bought this self-bubbling black charcoal mask. This is cleansing, toning and purifying. And again, this was 99p. Look at him. Any adorable. Um... This is extracts of charcoal and hyaluronic acid, lemon, orange, papaya and sugar cane. So that's going to be quite cool. 99p. Then for 99p each, I got these. These are metallic easy peel face masks. This is infused with retinol for deep cleaning and purifying. And the mask is purple. Then we have a brown mask, which is infused. It's like a greeny kind of colour. This is infused with coconut for cleansing and purifying. And then this mask is a goldy colour kind of thing. And this is infused with vitamin C, contains vitamin C, ginseng and bergamot for normal and dry skin to hydrate, purify and cleanse. And these were all 99p. Can you believe that? W7 are a really good brand. Now in QD they've got an entire makeup range that's like 99p a pound. I think the most expensive item was £7, and that was a palette from W7, which was quite nice as well. You've got them. Then I bought some hair accessories, because obviously, I mean, look at me, my hair's like really long. But all the kids are going back to school soon, which means parents are going to be looking for hair accessories to have the hair tied up so that they can have their masks. Because the one thing you don't want to do is keep catching your mask and pulling on your hair. So the first item I got were these little blue um, hair clips. They're in green, they've got a little butterfly, and that was 99p. Then for 99p, I got these purple glitter bows. I thought they would be gorgeous on a little girl. 
Then we got um, kind of, I want to say not teenage, but a bit more mature. Um, adults can wear these as well. These ones are in black and white, and then you've just got pure black. And again, they are just hair slides. They were 99p. Then for 99p, we got this big slide bow in this gorgeous velvet fabric as well. Then we got some gold and silver, maybe if it's a birthday or a party, not necessarily for school. Um, you get two gold, two silver, and again, they are hair slides, and they were 99p. Then for 99p, we got this big kind of Jojo bow-inspired bow. Again, 99p. Then we got two little hair bands, little scrunchies. Again, really stretchy, proper stretchy fabric on these. One is white with gold spots and one is black with gold spots. It would have been a, a lot better, I think, if they'd have had the white one. Ah, the black one with white spots. That was 99p. Then for 99p, I got this. I mean, look how cute that is for 99p. And again, it's a hair slide. So basically, in the summer, you just walk around like this, looking like Jojo. But obviously this is a carnation slash rose. Then we got this, which is an Alice band, which has this bow on the side with like these fake diamantes. Um, and that was also 99p. And this is called Amelia, the brand. Um, I don't know the brand for the, oh, they were mostly Amelia, I believe. Um, but the ones that didn't have a brand, so some of them were from the kids' stand, some of them were LD hair accessories. They all had, they were all on the same stand in the shop. And then the last one is this cute little blue one, which I absolutely love the colour. Um, it's coming up a little more blue on the screen, it's more like a pale grey. Oh, but isn't that just adorable with the little bow and obviously, I'd look so cute, but they're not for me. And that was everything I picked up. So I spent about £32 in total. Um, that's all the hair accessories, um, all the candles, all the bath bombs and everything. Absolute bargain. Um, I love QD and the fact that we have a big store now in our town. We did have one of these small offset QDs. Um, called Thingamy Bobs, if you're from the UK, um, that um, I go to all the time because we actually had one in the town centre. Um, but now they've closed that one for the new QD, um, which is the bigger store. And then obviously I had my envelopes. So that was everything. So in total, I paid £34.77, which I don't think is bad. Um, if you want to see more videos like this, give me a big thumbs up. I am going to try and film in QD at a later date. Today was their opening day. Um, but I'm going to see if I can try and film in the store at some point. Maybe on the sly, who knows. But if you want to see more, I have a B&M haul, a Poundland haul, and a One Below haul. So if you want to see more, give me a big thumbs up, like and subscribe. Comment down below your favourite items. Do you have a QD where you live? And I'll see you very soon for another video. Take care and thanks for watching. Love you all. Bye.